Today I'm going to show you how you can clean intake valves on your engine. Now in many modern vehicles, like this Ford EcoBoost, it's very important to make sure the intake valves are clean because they have what are called GDI engines. Now in GDI engines, which stands for gasoline direct injection, the injectors spray gas directly into the engine cylinders, not in the intake manifold. Now in an older fuel injection system like this Toyota, the fuel injectors sit on top of the intake manifold. They spray gas that goes over the intake valves and then is sucked into the engine. So you can see in this head that I pulled off, gasoline is sucked into the intake, goes into the valve and it actually can clean the valve because gasoline is a very good cleaner. Now in a GDI engine, the gasoline is sprayed with super high pressure injectors directly into the cylinder. It bypasses the intake valves so they can get a lot of deposits on them and clog up your engine. But you can clean these deposits yourself using the CRC GDI intake valve cleaner. Now the can itself has very good directions, but here's the basics that you need to do. You start up the engine and let it warm up to operating temperature. Then you find a vacuum line that goes to the intake to spray the cleaner in. In this old car, the vacuum brake booster line is here. It's real easy to get to. But the brake booster on this Ford is hidden way back inside. You'd have to take half the car apart to get to it. So we'll find a different vacuum line for that. We're gonna go right under here. There's a big vacuum hose here that we can use. And since there's not even filming room in there, here's what I'm going to be doing. Pulling off the vacuum line, getting a little rag like this, sticking it in the end of the open vacuum line, then getting a cleaner wand and pushing it the whole way through so it's now inside here and we can spray the cleaner into the engine. Then with the engine running about 2,000 RPM, you spray the cleaner in short bursts until the can is completely empty. It takes a few minutes. Then once the can is empty, you rub the engine up two or three times. Then let it idle for about a minute and shut the car off. And then you let the warm engine sit and the cleaner will heat soak about an hour so it can soften any other parts off and make it clean. And lastly comes the easy part. You just drive the car fast at highway speeds for about 10 minutes to clean it all out. So if you're worried about intake valve deposits on your modern car, now you know what to do about it. And remember, if you've got any car questions, just visit the Scotty Kilmer channel. And I'll answer them as soon as I'm done driving this car.